situation with the garden, except perhaps across the northwest of Scotland, because that's where the rain is going to be heaviest. A little bit getting down across Northern Ireland and eventually into Cumbria as well, but further south you can see really quite light and patchy. A mild night generally, so temperatures between 8 and 11 degrees. Through tomorrow then, this uh, band of cloud and rain, uh, with the rain diminishing all the while, will work its way down across the rest of England and Wales, little if any getting into that uh, southeast corner, with brighter skies falling on behind to most places as we get through in towards the afternoon. It's going to be a blustery day, though, across the northern half of the UK in particular. The strong winds bringing in uh, one or two scattered showers for Northern Ireland, but still some sunshine in between. Particularly strong winds across Scotland. Bear that in mind if you're heading for the hills or going out in a boat tomorrow. There will be gales over the coasts and hills through the day. A few showers through the afternoon across the northwest of England. Some good sunny spells developing, though, further south. And a much brighter afternoon, I think, after a cloudy morning across East Anglia and the southeast. And the temperature is still a bit above average, generally the uh, mid to high teens. A noticeable breeze coming in though and that freshening wind will bring increasing amounts of cloud to the southwest of England and to Wales as well through the afternoon so it looks like a rather damp end to the day here but uh, more rain to come if you're looking for some rain for the garden there's another chance I think through the early half of next week still a generally unsettled scene. Bye bye. Yeah let's have a look shall we. What's the first?